take one. And action. You are actually very serious when you are recording. <laughs> What did I learn today? Well, I learned that uh, there is a great uh, Python community in Prague and it would be great to organize maybe the next Europe Python there. That would be fantastic. A great city, great people, great beer. That, uh, that would be fantastic. Um, today, today I learned, uh, well, how to do an interview, I guess. <laughs> the community, the people, and talking and learning new things. I don't know, it's fun. We had a really interesting discussion about Europython society and you know how um, things were before, how things are right now. There were some really interesting conversations about what could be done to be like more community centered, uh, for us to be more community centered, how we can help more open source um, organizations and more specifically just be more closer to the community. So today at Europython I learned about how uh, the new Python versions will be optimized and how they will run faster. I think that's great news for the future of Python. Europython is uh, the gathering of uh, different groups, different folks, different uh, ideas. And, uh, but uh, everybody is sticking together with a common language, which is Python. Something I really liked learning about, which was really cool, was uh, these VS Code pets, which you can have some pets running around in VS Code. And what I really like about your Python is, uh, now that we're not remote anymore, is actually talking to people, meeting people, and interacting, and uh, especially comparing uh, uh, developer setups, which we were just doing just now. That's really cool. Uh, during uh, our preparations for Europython, I have learned some animal parts, like uh, that giraffes have actually vocal uh, uh, vocals and uh, they can speak. Everything everyone does, does with Python and that's probably one of my favorite things. And is the surprises you get from even when you read the abstracts of the talks and you get you think you know what they're going to be talking about and then you go to a talk that you think you will not enjoy that much and it just completely blows your mind. And that's that's really really cool. This year in Europython, I learned about, a lot about the streaming and uh, video cameras and all the things. Knowing people and uh, knowing many uh, different society, Europython society member and Python uh, community members, that I think it's very important if you want to be occupied, uh, if you want to participate, if you want to join this community. I think my favorite thing about Europython as well. The people, the people of Python are just fantastic. It's the best people I've ever met. For me, it's like a nerd camp for all the nerds. So it's really nice to meet all the people that I see only once per year at the conference. Uh, talks are really nice. I I learned, for example, about linters for the import statements, which I still have to read about, but I learned quite a lot from that talk. This year, meeting a lot of friends in person. So I've been in Europe for three years and this is my first time meeting all of you uh, in real life and that was uh, just a minute. Was I got five, minute, five minutes to prepare for a session chair and then after all I got loads of people coming and saying thank you and they say that they loved it. So I think that was a great job <laughs> and I had fun doing it. I think every, every day there is something new and funny. I think it's just fantastic. Uh, highly recommend Europython and hopefully see you next year.